What's going on everybody? Welcome back to the channel and in this video we're going to have a look at the 1996 Marvel Vision set from Fleer and Skybox. Now this set's pretty unique. Um, I kind of don't want to give it away. We'll go ahead and look at that once we head into the deep dive. But in the meantime, if you like what I'm doing on this channel, go ahead and hit the subscribe button, like the video, and without further ado, let's go. Alrighty, so the 1996 Marvel Vision set from Fleer and Skybox does consist of 100 base cards. Um, it does have a chase set. You know what? I'll go ahead and uh, we'll go ahead and look at that at the very end. But what makes this set unique is it comes with these encryptalizers, right? So it's like a little red cellophane looking thing right here. All right. And on the back of these cards is a little question here. It says, what is Peter Parker's job at the Daily Bugle? Now, if you really don't know the answer, you'll go ahead and grab the encryptalizer and you put it right over. And as you can see, photographer. So that's a pretty cool gimmick, you know. And the way how these cards are, I'm not too sure if you can see. These cards are embossed. So it's like it's it's stamped a bit. Um, you can see the, the little grooves and the divots back here. That's what kind of makes this set a bit unique is um, is the embossed na nature of these uh, cards here. Anyway, let's go ahead and start off here. So number one, we got Spider-Man. Number two, we got Alien Costume Spider-Man. And number three, we got Spider-Man Six Arms. Kind of weird. Number four, we got Spider-Man. This is a team up with Blade. Another team up, we got Spider-Man and the Punisher. Spider-Man and Wolverine. We got J. Jonah Jameson. Peter Parker. Who is Peter Parker's only living relative? Anybody know? Aunt May. See, that's cool. Next up, we got Chameleon. Dr. Octopus. Hobgoblin. Got the Kingpin. Craven the Hunter. The Lizard. Mysterio. Rhino. Scorpion. Shocker. Tombstone. You got Venom. Then you got Spider-Man versus Dr. Octopus. Spider-Man versus the Lizard. Spider-Man versus Mysterio. Spider-Man versus Rhino. And Spider-Man versus Venom. Up next, we got the X-Men set here. We got Beast. What is the X-Men's training room called? Anybody know? It's a danger room, right? Is it? Yeah, the danger room. You got Bishop. 
is actually pretty interesting. What X-Men does Bishop believe to be the traitor? Oh, it's a gambit. Okay. We got Cable. Colossus. Cyclops. Yeah, Gambit. Jean Grey. Jubilee. Long shot. Got a night crawler. Professor X. You got Havoc. You got Rogue. Storm. Wolverine. Apocalypse. Juggernaut. Magneto. Mr. Sinister. Got Mystique. Omega Red. Sabretooth. Sauron. You got the White Queen. And we got the, we're heading into the battles. You got Cyclops versus Mr. Sinister. Gambit versus Bishop. Jubilee versus Juggernaut. We got Rogue versus Sauron. Wolverine versus Sabretooth. And then we got the Fantastic Four set. We got Mr. Fantastic. Invisible Woman. Human Torch, Thing, Doctor Doom, Galactus, Hydro Man. Claw, Medusa, Super Scroll, Terax, Trapster. Wizard, Daredevil,
Ghost Rider. You got the Hulk. You got Nova. You got Thor. And we got some of the battles here. We got Thing versus Hulk. We got the Human Torch versus Super Scroll. Invisible Woman versus Puppet Master. Mr. Fantastic versus Doctor Doom. Thing versus Galactus. Next, we head into the Iron Man set. First off, yeah, Iron Man. That's pretty cool. And then you got Iron Man Exo Battle Armor. This kind of gives, I guess, what the um, what components are in his armor there. You got Iron Man Deep Space Armor. Got the Iron Man Hydro Armor. You got War Machine. You got Hawkeye. You got Spider Woman. You got Sentry. Scarlet Witch. Beetle. You got the Crimson Dynamo. Fin Fang Foom Mandarin Modoc The Controller Titanium Man Ultimo We got the battles we got Iron Man versus Backlash. I'm oh, sorry Blacklash Iron Man versus the Crimson Dynamo Iron Man versus Fin Fang Foom Iron Man versus Mandarin. Iron Man versus Titanium Man. And last but not least, as always, the checklist. Okay, now, I did say that this actually... Let's put these four out here. That these actually didn't have a chase set but it does come with these little mini magazines but I guess what the chase set actually is is these little is these little tattoos you guys re remember these These little temporary tattoos I'm not too sure if these are still a thing Oop, that's that might be upside down who knows spider-man kind of crawls on walls anyway yeah so these are basically what I think are the actual chase set is these tattoos here. So I think it came in like one in every pack. And then these little mini magazines, 
Oh look, there's there's more to I haven't even op opened these. Hobgoblin and the lizard here. That's pretty cool. So you got some of these things right here. The little crossword puzzles. And if you were to score everything, this this would be your I guess your rating. Oh, of course, the answers. You know what? Let's put these ta tattoos back in there. Get back in there, tattoos. Let's see what the Iron Man one has here. Anything cool? Oh, the Iron Man and the Hydra armor. All right. Oh, wait, there's more. War Machine and Fin Fang Foom. Cool, cool, cool. I haven't opened these up in years. I totally forgot what's what's actually in here. Let's look at the Human Torch one here. We got a couple of tattoos. Got the thing, Mr. Fantastic, and the Human Torch. Any more hiding? Nope. That that's it. All right. Alright, last let's go open up the Wolverine mini mag. Oh, these ones don't have any tattoos. Bummer. Alright, and that is it. Let's go ahead and go back up to FaceTime view. I'll give you guys my final thoughts and we'll go ahead and end this video. And that was a look at the 1996 Marvel Vision set from Fleer and Skybox. Now, to be completely honest, I actually love this set. I think this set is pretty cool. Um, with the addition of the uh, embossed nature of, of how these cards are, I think it adds a little bit of a value. Now, as, as a collector standpoint, I think this is a pretty good set to try and find. Um, it's relatively not super expensive, so you can go ahead and probably find it maybe right now on the market on the second hand market like like ebay or something within about 25 to 35 at the time of this recording i mean um prices have basically doubled or tripled within the past few months but if i had to put this on a tier list honestly this would sit at a firm b firm b i think um i can't quite give it an a tier but I still love the set. Other than that, guys, if you like what I'm doing here, if you like what you guys see here, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. Comment right down below. Let, let me know what, um, what other sets you want to see featured on this channel. And chances are, I mean, I have quite a few sets. So chances are I might have them. Um, don't forget to hit that like button on the way out. And I'll see you guys back next time with a brand new set. Thank you guys so much for watching.